If the other parent is violating terms of possession and access in your decree, there are a variety of options, but it can really depend on the nature of the violations as to whether or not you have a viable enforcement case. Something to keep in mind is that in order for an order to be enforceable, you have to be following it to the letter. For example, if your possession order says that you were supposed to pick up your child at six o'clock from the other parent's residence, the other parent says, oh, I'm not home, you can't have the child today, and you do not show up to act at six o'clock as required by the order, then you cannot enforce that. So even if you have been told you're not gonna get to see the child or we're not home or we're on vacation, it is only enforceable if you take that extra step of showing up at the time and place designated in the, designated in the order. Now that other parent is in contempt. We can file an enforcement proceeding in, in that situation and seek a variety of remedies from the courts. We can seek uh, makeup time if a parent has been withholding access. We can seek jail time for somebody who is flagrantly violating their court order. And if a person is found in contempt, most likely they will be ordered to pay the other side's attorney's fees.